flexing, yeah. Cause I just checked my bank account and I'm good. I'm flexing, yeah. Cause my singles going off in my hood. I'm flexing, yeah. Everywhere I go, you know it's all love. I'm flexing. Yo, what's good, Crazy Nation? It's your boy, S.U. <laughs> the Crazy. You know what it is. I'm back again with another reaction. This is to Baby Monster Drip on SBS. Let's get it. Let's go. Yeah. When I dress, I don't think so much. I could be the goat that I need too much. I'ma set the goal. I'ma eat that lunch. Baby, so cold. Get the mm. ice cream truck. Ah, uh, see the titty, kitty, kitty, little boy, guy. This is what I wanted to hear. This is what I wanted to hear. Back, 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 back. Let's reload the thing. This is what I wanted to hear. This is what I wanted to hear. I wanted to hear their voices. And you can hear them. I yeah. love them. When I dress, I don't think so much. I could be the gold that I need so much. Because I want to hear how much like Chiquita's improved in like rapping and stuff like that. So it's like the best way to hear the way Chiquita raps. Uh. When I dress, I don't think so much. I could be the goal, but I need so yeah, much. Probably. I'ma set the goal, I'ma eat that lunch. Baby, so cold, get the ice cream truck. Ah, kitty, 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 little boy, guy. Kitty, kitty, yeah, we gonna run this town. Hitting me up, cause I got what they like. Baby, got no chance, but I hit that. Oh, he is. Nah, 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 I'll be there. Gonna be nothing, my aunt. Nah, 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 I'll be there. My soul is. Beautiful, Ruka. Yeah, it, it sounds even better, like the Ruka part. They like baby got no chance, but I hit that dance. Mm. Nah, 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 I'll be there, gonna be nice. It has more power than the than the original version. Hey, Asa? Wow. Oh, Laura. I'm curious about this part. The you know, you know how we call it, Majo? What do we call it? The... What, what is it that we call them? The, um... The anchor. That's what I want. I want to hear the anchor. Yeah, I want to hear the anchors, anchor voices in this part. Especially Rami's part. Rami's part sounds amazing in this song. Beautiful, funny stuff. Wow, wow, that's actually really nice. It's powerful and very clear and very clean, which everyone's gonna be like, obviously, Parita does that, but this really stands out. I love it. Yeah, do you know what it reminds me of? Mion and. Oh, who was I just thinking about? I had someone else in my mind. Ah, oh, Sunyun. It reminds me of Sunyun. It's because she's she sings. She has that low tone that Sunyun has, and that's the thing. Parita's very versatile, so I'm not surprised that she reminds us of those singers. It has that brightness of Mion, but that. Um, it's that low tone of Sulyun, which is very impressive. And you know, Sulyun's mad, mad versatile as well. So it's a great combination. How sharp that light is. Are you ready? Set, turn on the lights. I need this one. Baby got passion, ambition. I'm bored at the sea. Look at that. Mm. Um, 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 Oh, that sounds even better live. We're the best of rest. Yeah. 
best did you hear that different twang that Chiquita sang with on this one? I'm blown away on how strong of a rhythm they're singing in part onto the song, not just following the instrumental. But that's why I said I needed to listen to the live version. That's why I say that, because to me, listening to live versions like this brings so much, give, it brings so much into the song. Because to me, the perfect example is Mamamoo. Mamamoo. Um, Big Bang, 21, even Blackpink are like that. They're very, when it comes to live performances, they know how to deliver the lyrics. And that like they set up always for like the next voice. You know what I mean? And people are about to say, I can't believe you just put Blackpink in the same wording as Mama Moore. But what I mean with Blackpink specifically is their rapping. Specifically, they're rapping because Lisa and Jenny's raps are very similar to Baby Monsters. The impact of their rapping really, it really punches. And not only that, they're very sharp. While as well, you got Rosé's vocals, which always lead into Jiso. Either Jiso's vocals leads into Rosé's, that it's always the structure of the song. And when you get to hear live versions of it, you get to understand it in more of a clearer way of how the song's perfectly structured for each member. And that's why I like to see live performances, especially on the radios, because you get to hear more. You get to hear way more than what the TV shows give you. Way more than that, which is so important. So YG, when we have Blackpink, let's, let's do that in seven now. Yeah, pretty much. What's interesting is, I feel like it's like, we have Blackpink, but this is like, let's make a group that's more like Blackpink, but with more rosés. With more than just one rosé. Baby Monster feels a bit more versatile in their sound. Yeah, but not only that, they're all strong. I feel like, like the fact that I even compared Parita to Sulyun, just says how strong I think her voice is. Like that says a lot. Cause Sulyun's probably one of the most versatile singers in K-pop. <laughs> like right now. So the fact that I'm even comparing her to her says a lot. Or like, you know, that's very interesting. But this is really good. This is really good though. This sounds amazing. I wanna do this I like how she sings it. I like how she does I'll be there. It's not there, it's there. It, there's like an accent to it. And I like it. It adds like a certain twang, which is really nice. Irish. Nice, buddy, though. Here we go. Wow. 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 Beautiful, but yet powerful. I, lo I love this group. I love this group so much. It's so good. But all of them, it's all of them. Even Parita's part here, it's so strong. Parita's part here. This is how strong this is. Just ooh. It, and same as Rami, soft but strong. And then this. Nice, oh my god, I just remembered what song this is. The fucking bridge. <laughs> I just remember what. <laughs> oh, 
That is beautiful. See how excited Chiquita. What was that? I know it just went. He turned around. <laughs> Even I was like, "You good?" Bro? This is why when people said that when she sings it live, it's gonna fuck it up. No, she's learned. She's learning to how to control her voice. Because well, when I heard this note, I was like, she's probably going to do what she ended up doing with Sheesh, which she ended up, once it went high, she, she stops it. She lets it fade instead of keep on going higher. Because that's what I was worried about. And you can tell how nervous she was. Like, I love what the members did. I love what Chiquita did. I love what, Asa did, they're like, yo, you're good, like, you got, you can see that they're helping her, like, oi, like, you're you, like, remember who you are, like, but what's funny is, is how much they hype her, <laughs> she's just pointing to her, like, yeah, and she's just, like, full hyping her, and I love her, because <laughs> this is how, they know, they know they're monsters, like, they know it. This is the thing about this group. They know who they are already. They know, like, how... I don't think people understand that they understand how talented they are already. When she was in the middle of it, she started to look so cheeky. Yeah, I got this. Yeah. Look at... Like, you see it. You see, like, they, they make sure, like, oh, you're good. But to be fair, I understand her being that nervous. Because that is not an easy note to hit at all. <laughs> It's not an easy note. That's why when I was, I was like, oh shit. Like, I remember, I'm like, oh yeah, this is this song. I'm like, oh fuck, okay, this is gonna be insane. This is gorgeous, by the way. This is gorgeous, by Rome. Crazy. Crazy. Crazy that she hits that. It's crazy. Ooh, nice roll. <laughs> Chiquita. Yeah. I. Because the thing is, that takes a lot out of her. That would take a lot out of her. Because to have the. When you think about that high note, the biggest bitch about that high note is how long she holds it for. It's how long she holds that note for. And not only that, she's going up, up. What I notice is she goes up, down, then up. I was listening to someone explain that and I was like, oh, that makes sense. And it's interesting because it's crazy how she can sing like that. Like, I don't think people understand that note is not easy at all. That is a disgusting note like that's why i was like oh i need to hear this it all it all but i love that i love that all the members are like yeah you did it and like they all were hyping her when she hits it and that just brings a 
amazing smile to my face because Jesus, man, this group, this group is so talented. This was also a big showdown for BM versus the audio cables. Some of them even needed to hold their in in my packs. Yeah, I noticed that. I noticed that, and that was crazy. I was like, far out, man. Y'all don't understand how hard it is to never fail. And high note, Ion is a Korean treasure. Ion made us believe that that high note was easy, but the pressure for her to do well on that part is so high as well. You'll see her prepping herself. I think that thing about... What showed me a lot was the way that she was breathing after she hit it. Which means that that high note takes a lot out of her. Like, a lot. Because, I, like I said, I don't think people understand what she's doing. Like, I don't think people understand, like, how much that, that would take out of you. And I wouldn't be surprised as well that that would make, that would make some people lightheaded. Because it's, that it's just the tones that she's hitting. And not only that, she's holding the note. Understanding the point of like holding the note is so important and it's not easy to do. It takes a lot of power out of you, but it looked as comfortable as possible. Yeah, but it shows you her reaction after. The reaction after shows everything that it's not easy for her to hit. You know what I mean? Like that shows everything. That shows everything about that note where it's just like, shit, man, this is high. Like, it's to the point where it's very interesting because you can tell, like, you can tell, you can tell she's nervous as well. You can tell, like, she's really nervous before hitting this note. Like, I'm looking at her perfect example, Magic. We're looking at her face right now, right? This is before she hits the note. That face is a pout. That face is a pout, like, oh, fuck. Well, you see, I thought, and <laughs> she keeps on, like, you got this, right? <laughs> and they're laughing because it's like, at least we don't have to hit it. <laughs> That's the reality of it. That's the reason. They know they don't have to hit it, so they don't worry about it. <laughs> That's that bad time where it's like, nah, bro, you got this. <laughs> You know, it's like bad time. Like, yeah, you got this very easy. Yeah, exactly. But what was cool was like once she started to hit it, you see all of the members are like losing their shit. Like they all got excited for her. Which that's what was one of the most interesting things. But I've noticed that's a big thing in this group. When it comes to the rapping, when it comes to the singing. Rora, like it's always that case where they're like, they're always backing each other. If you know what I mean. Like, look, you see, even here, Majo, you see that they're all getting excited. Look, Chiquita's, Chiquita's smiling like, I am ready to be blessed by the gods. Um, <laughs> Asa's like hyping her. You know, Rora is giving her the mic and going, go and sing. Like look, all of them besides Ruka, Ruka, Ruka's like you got this. Just I trust my, I trust my, I trust my main vocalist. I'll, I'll look away. I'll look away and know she's gonna hit this shit. You know, it's cool. It's I like seeing the hype for from the members. Like that's one of the best things. Even even Parita, Parita, Parita's looking at it like a proud mother. Just like yeah, you got this. You know. It's like that proud, like, sister type thing where it's like, yo, you got this. Like, hit that shit, you know? And that's mad. That's, it just shows you how strong this group is together. You know? Like, that's one thing that I noticed as well. Is that it shows how strong their group are. And not only that. What made me very happy is seeing Ion dance after it. You know, like Ion's going back to the Ion that I love seeing. 
where she's having fun. Even though she's nervous, like she's having fun with her members. You know what I mean, Majin? You remember how we were worried about that at one point? We're like, man, like it looks like she's in her own world. Like, and you look at her now and it's like, well, to be fair, having Chiquita and Asa next, next to you, that must help a lot. Like, between the two members, like, they're very out there. Between, <laughs> between those two members, like, <laughs> I think Chiquita's like, I have to stand next to you because I can hype you up. And it's mad. It's cool to see. Like, like I said, I, I love what this group is doing. I'm excited to see more performances, like I said, when they start going back on tour. Um, I'm keen to see this. Obviously, I know they did Click Clack as well, but it hasn't dropped yet, so I'm going to be waiting for that one. I'm actually curious to hear the Click Clack one live. That one's very interesting to me because I feel like that's going to be very different. I feel like that live is going to give more than any of the audio versions that I've heard so far. I feel like that's I'm going to get a different opinion on baby monster in that way because i'm curious to hear how rami raps live you know what i mean like this type of live where it's like there's not really much i'm very intrigued and same as chiquita and all the members but honestly i really enjoyed this this was one of my favorite ones like i said halfway through this i was like oh yeah i still have rami's fucking low note on the bridge that's gonna send me crazy then I got Ion's high note, which is going to send me to the stars. You know, like, I was like, I was so excited. I was like, oh, yes. I go, I go, this is why I like dropped everything. And I was like, oh, bro, I want to react to this. That's why I straight away, imagine I messaged you. I was like, are you on? Like, please tell me you're awake. <laughs> I was like, fuck, I go. I was about to go to bed. And then I saw this and I was like, oh, fuck yeah, I'm reacting to this. I got so excited. I was like, yeah, I'm reacting to this because... Ah, I love what Baby Monster do. That's the reality. But yeah, that's all I'm going to say. So if y'all like this, give this a thumbs up. No, no, no. Comment if you want to see more. Subscribe. And remember, keep living a crazy life and stay blessed. Not only that, if you haven't seen any of my other reactions to Baby Monster, in my description, there's a playlist. If you haven't watched my album reaction, my drip album reaction, it's in there as well. There's heaps of performances on there as well. Yeah, just check it out. But yeah, that's all I'm going to say. Peace. Ladies. Ow.